Uh, I had some technical difficulties, but I'm now back with part two of my hair does not want to look good, so I'm wearing a hat. Now this is my Q&A, and I'm just going to get back into it. Um, let's see here. Was there any kind of denial on your part of your uh, of your previous condition? I mean, did you ever kind of think that there was never anything wrong? Well, I kind of did think that at a po at one point, but that's because I the the idea that I might have a thing, you know, mentally, never actually crossed my mind, and it's not something that you just in the middle of it you start thinking, hmm, could I be insane? It just doesn't really happen like that, I guess, at least not for me. So um, there was a time when I th when I thought that I wasn't sick, but I don't I wouldn't call it denial because. It was more like on awareness. Uh, do I have a girlfriend? Um, no, I do not. Uh, what model is my guitar? It looks awesome. See, my guitar is actually not a guitar. Uh, it's about time I show it. It's a bass, uh, and it's dusty. It's a Dean Metal Man, which uh, with four strings, and the amp is broken, so I can't actually play it for you either. Sorry about that. Might do that one day when I get it fixed. How many tattoos do I have and what are they? I think I'd show, I've shown those. How old am I? I'm 23. What kind of career do I want? Do I write? She writes poetry and paints. So, hence her question wondering what puts me in a creative mood. I don't know what kind of career I want. I talked about that. But, um, creative mood. Energy in general puts me in a creative mood, I think. Um, but it's, it's, it's weird, it's different what motivates me, it's never really the same thing. Uh, do you ever get tired of making these videos because you have to dwell on it all, in the sense of having to talk about the past even though it may slash may not affect you currently? Um, well, I guess I have been getting tired of it for periods of time, but I, that's when I haven't been making any videos. Uh, in general, I would say no. I, I I'm not tired of it, I just signed off on that YouTube partner program thing um, that they let everyone into now and I just, you know, for fun and uh, you know, that's keeping keeping my interests as well so, so expect more videos I'm uh, gonna be making more and I intend to once I figure out something to make them about Can I show my tattoos and what do they mean? I don't know where I that if you're Danish, how did you learn English fluently? Well, I used to live in the U.S. I went to high school in Ohio, Centerville. Uh, have you ever watched Criminal Minds? On the show, there's a character, Spencer Reed, who looks... Spencer Reed, I've been compared to this guy a lot, uh, and I have been looking him up, and I don't see it that much, but you never really do with yourself, so I guess you tell me. Uh, not the worst one I could look like, definitely. Uh, let's see. Have I ever had a gay experience? Not that I can think of. Um, so hey, not doing big hopes you're gonna answer my guess. No, that's a long one, so I'm gonna skip to the actual question. I was wondering if a random person could come down with schizophrenia. How was it with you? Some first symptoms? How were you when your illness was discovered and how? Um, well, a random person could theoretically just come down with it for no reason, uh, so there's really no use being scared of it or anything like that. If you think you have it, just get it checked. Uh, some first symptoms, I don't actually recall because I wasn't looking for symptoms in my behavior back then. And how old was I when it was discovered I was 21? Um, and that was actually the last one I had picked out. No, nope. wait. There's one more that I forgot to copy paste, but here is uh, my necklaces anyway. This one is uh, Mjolnir, Hammer of Thor. And this one, I don't know what this is. I got it from my mom. She thought it was a flute. Evidently not. Um, that was the final one. So, thanks you guys for watching, and uh, I will be making more of these videos, the Q&A ones, uh, in case someone wants to ask questions, and I'm gonna just keep stockpiling questions that I like, and then post a video about them every now and then. So that's gonna be a regular thing. Maybe you'll do it once a week or something like that. Um, 
Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, bye.